so hey guys welcome back to the dnn medical series if it's your first time joining us don't forget to like comment share and subscribe so you can find us on youtube if you search in d and n medical series bam yeah and you just click that and you just click subscribe when the subscribe button comes up anywhere in any video or just on the web page so today guys i want to inform you about something super important it's how to sign up for the ue payment plan let me try to type that in so that's the payment plan right so we know that the tuition is super expensive the hall fees are super expensive so not many persons are fortunate enough to cover these by themselves or to cover these all at once so we're going to do a tutorial on how to sign up for the payment plan so we use this using the UE boss system. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to search UE boss. So we'll find out what boss means when the page loads. So it's bursary online student system. So this is this is a system that deals with the monetary things, financial installment plans for uh, halls, tuition so on and so forth so the first thing you click ue boss then you're going to put in your id number this page will come up and then you put in your password and then you just click login so this page will this page will come up that tells you about your request the things that you have done or any transaction that you have done using the boss system and so on so for the payment plan we're interested in forms so they there are criterias for the payment plan so if it's a tuition installment plan Okay, let me just say, you can get many plans. You can get tuition installment plan. You can get resident installment plan. That's if you live on halls and so on and so forth. You can sign up for other things. So they have a bunch of things here. Different type of forms and so on. If you take student loans, they have some forms for some things. I'm not sure about those, but yeah. You can check those out if this meets your criteria and so on. So we're interested in tuition plan, right? So today we're going to select that. So the criteria will come up. So they give you a lot of things that you need to know before you come to this form. The first and most important one is that your miscellaneous fees must be covered. That's your insurance. That's $15,610 in 2019, just in case somebody watched this video in 2020. But in 2019, it was $15,610 for persons who does not live on halls. But if you live on campus, it's a little bit more expensive. I don't remember the exact figure. So your miscellaneous fee must be paid, right? Another important thing is that at least 25% of your tuition for the current semester must be covered before you apply. So let us try to check something out with a calculator. So if you're to, you're doing MBBS and your tuition is US $28,000 yearly, um, you'd probably say, okay, you're going to pay per semester if you don't have it all at once. So 28 divided by 2, 28,000 divided by 2, so that's $14,000 per semester. So 25, you need to pay 25% of this 14,000 US dollars before you can sign up for the plan. So 25% times $14,000. So let's see. So that's roughly three thousand five hundred US dollars. So you'd pay three thousand five hundred US dollars before you come to this page to sign up for the plan. So that's roughly. Let's put that in Jamaican. So that's roughly four hundred and seventy-six 
thousand dollars you'd pay before you come to sign up for the tuition installment plan so that's if your school fee or your tuition is twenty eight thousand dollars if your tuition is six hundred and fifty thousand dollars so you would probably pay that's six fifty divided by two is roughly 325 so you're paying roughly 325 per semester so it's per semester so it's quarter of 325,000 dollars so you'd pay $81,250 at SAS before you come to the plan before you come to this boss page for to look about the plan understand hope that is clear so you have to pay 25 percent of your tuition for the semester because the plan is for a semester basis it's not for the entire year so when january comes if you did the plan in september to december when january comes you have to apply for another payment plan for that semester right so you have to pay 25 percent for the semester fee and you have to pay your miscellaneous fee so you pay all of these at SAS before the deadline so in september 2019 the deadline for the the installment plan it's is september 13th friday september 13 2019 so if you're watching this in 2020 this video might be a little different so you should check this out with the services that the school offers so this is specifically for year 2019 just in case next year somebody watch this video so remember pay your miscellaneous fees and quarter of the semester's tuition before you come to this page because you can't access the form if you don't pay the miscellaneous fee or the 25 percent of the semester's tuition at sas or any bill express or online and so on and so forth so the next thing is to select go to form so this will come up they tell you their criteria so on and so forth and tell you that it does no way release you from your financial obligation so not because you're on a payment plan you say okay i paid this and i should not pay anything else or i should pay it when i like it's not like that because the tuition installment plan is a monthly thing after you pay the quarter you're going to pay your additional money every month before the 31st of every month so that your plan is in hold or not in hold so that your plan is going on to cover all your semester's tuition so you know it will vary based on the amount of your tuition the amount that you pay monthly so you just press continue then your information if you pay the 25 percent you'll access this page if you did not pay it you have no access to this page so your information will come up like your name your id your faculty your program so on and so forth and then you're just going to fill out the form so you have your title miss mr whatever your address your occupation your, your social security number if you're international or your trn if you're jamaican and so on and so forth your telephone number your email address or you can add a sponsor so if your parents are responsible for paying for you you add their details so nothing you do nothing but to just add their names uh their address their email address their phone number and their trn number as well and they'll send an email to them to say yes so and so has been i've made a plan with the university blah 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 so they'll send an email to your sponsor because there's a thing that says we have the right to contact your sponsor so don't put anybody as your sponsor if you don't want them to know anything about your business and so on so that's basically it the plan details will come up next you put on so your plan detail is on next and you'll see the current semester and it will automatically put in the amount that you have outstanding for that semester so you don't need to put that in and it'll tell you that the installment plan is for three months if you sign up in September 
and you just other things are optional you can just click continue and they'll send you an email for the confirmation and so on and so forth and they'll review it in roughly three to five business days and give you an answer to see if you got through with the plan so most of the times you get it and so on and so forth the fact that they see that you have financial needs and so on and so forth you'll get the plan in three to five business days and they'll tell you how much to pay monthly and so on and so forth so that's basically it for the URIT payment plan I hope you guys have a wonderful semester and don't forget to like comment share and subscribe thank you for listening guys bye